roar. Don't worry if it tastes really powerfully of the honey more than the berries at first, or right after you add it. Don't worry about that. Once it's had a chance to settle a while, the berry will take back over. Don't worry. It's gonna be fine. Normally you would want to do this with something that has smaller seeds, like, you know, um, raspberry or a blueberry, or, you know, any mixture of berries you like. That's that's the nice thing about this. You can really do it with anything. I just use blackberry because that's what I have. You know, blackberries just grow everywhere around here. You know, I picked these just, you know, walking you know, about a mile. That's the big problem that blackberries have. Everybody loves the flavor, but everybody hates the seeds. That's why, that's why they use blackberries to make so many different hybrids. They always, they're always trying to cross it with things to, you know, keep the flavor of the blackberry, but to make the seeds a little bit smaller. I think that's where things like a Marion Berry came from, or like uh, Huckleberry? Is Huckleberry one of them? Or Boysenberry? I can't, you see, I can't even keep track of which ones are, you know, themselves and which ones are hybrids. Like, there's, I got this stuff right now, a jam made of Olali Berry? I've never heard of that anywhere. I got it at a farmer's market. That's the only time I've ever heard of it. But, yeah, it, it tastes pretty good, so, yeah, whatever. <laughs>